Hello all and welcome back. Today we are going to create this beautiful animation using PowerPoint. Let's get started. Let's first enable the guides and draw rectangle shape along the width of slide. Adjust its size and align it centrally to slide. Make it no outline and fill it with light gray color. Again go to insert tab and draw another rectangle as shown. Make it no outline and format it with two step linear gradient. Set its direction to vertical and change stop colors with different shades of red color. Next go to insert tab and draw rounded rectangle shape as shown. Make it completely rounded and make sure all rectangle shapes are of same height. Make it no outline and format it with same two step linear gradient. Change the stop colors with white and light gray color. Apply outer shadow effect and adjust transparency and blur values. Let's zoom in and then draw a circle shape at the center holding down Ctrl and Shift keys. Make it no outline and match its fill color with background using eyedropper tool. Now group these two shapes together and duplicate it 5 more times using Ctrl plus D. Decide the first and last positions and then distribute all shapes horizontally. Now ungroup all shapes and match each circle fill colors with background using eyedropper tool. Next go to insert tab and draw a line over first rectangle shape as shown. Change its fill color, line weight and dash type. Next go to insert tab and draw small circle over this line. Make it no outline and fill it with dark gray color. Now drag this line and circle shape holding down Ctrl and Shift keys and place them on each rectangle shapes as shown. Make sure all shapes are in line with each other.
Finally add heading text field on each of these elements as shown. Next we will animate all these shapes. Let's go to animation tab and enable animation pane. Select first two rectangle shapes and apply wipe animation. Set their animation direction opposite to each other. Next select all six rounded rectangle shapes and apply float in animation. Select every alternate rectangle shapes and change their direction to down. Let's quickly preview the animation once. Looks good. Next select first small circle shape and apply appear animation. Then go to add animation option and apply line motion path animation. Drag the red color endpoint and change line motion path direction as shown. Start it after previous, reduce duration to 1 second and apply end bounce effect of 0.6 seconds. Next select line shape and apply wipe animation. Start it with previous and set delay duration to 0.25 seconds. Next select circle shape, apply zoom animation and start it after previous. Finally apply zoom animation to heading text field and start it after previous. Let's preview the animation once. Looks perfect. Now making use of animation painter, apply first circle animation to second circle. Again dragging the red color endpoint, change direction of line motion path animation as shown. Next apply first line animation to second line and change its wipe animation direction. Continue to apply animations to small circle and heading text but there is no need to change the directions. So if we preview the animation now, this is how it looks like. Continue to use animation painter and apply similar set of animations to every alternate shapes. Make sure to apply these animations in a defined sequence from left to right.
So here is the final preview. Hope you all liked it. Please don't forget to like, share and comment. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.